right, guys, I am shocked at what they actually have in here today. Um, as you saw up front, there was tons of stuff. So we've got some of these spring Pokeballs. We actually have some of the little Brilliant Card, Brilliant Stars card blisters that have the promo cards, Eevee and Flapple. So we'll probably have to get a few of those. We've got quite a few of these battle decks with Gardevoir and Victini. Um, these other tins here, though, are what I'm really excited to see. I don't think I've actually seen these. These are some type of says Sun and Moon Canto tins when I scan the barcode. So I'm definitely going to have to get some of those to try, too. They also have a few of these Slowbro and Mew tins, as well as some of these Tornadus, Thunders, and Landris packs. So, um, yeah, another, looks like another Slowbro there. So definitely some really good stuff. I'm kind of mixed. I love these Pokeballs, but we already have a lot of those that we've kind of collected. So probably gonna go for these spring tins or Kanto tins. As y'all saw from the video today, I went to Walmart and did see a few items that we actually haven't seen before. So decided to pick a few up and we'll just see what we get from them today. So we're gonna go ahead and get started with the mystery box first. We haven't actually seen these ourselves in stores, so they had a ton of them. I did go ahead and get the little plastic wrap off. Um, before we get in there is three booster packs and one online code card. And it says the chase pack is seated one in 10 and look for randomly inserted vintage packs. One in 10, that's pretty good. I don't know, you know, here, clearly, they, you know, are showing your base yeah, set and you got Charizard pack. And then on the back, there's Vivid, Chilling, and Shining Legends, which I would also love to get Shining Legends, too. Um, so, we will see what we get. I've seen a few other people open these, but... Oh! Well, this looks like some other ones we've opened. Oh. Fates Collide, I mean, that would have been a decent set, too. These so, just always hurt me. <laughs> why do they do this? I don't know. This is just like, this is painful looking for these packs. But anyway, we'll go ahead and get into darkness first. I mean, I guess their theory is like the cardboard helps protect them, so it's better than just throwing the booster pack in there. Maybe, they, it's like it's all bent up, so it just makes me really question, are they The gonna... cardboard didn't do anything wrong. No, <laughs> poor cardboard. So we'll have to see. They had a lot of these. I'm just, I'm curious, like if we don't get anything, I still may get some more just cause I really would like to know, like, is there actually something out there? Is there a base set pack inside these mystery boxes? Or is it like that false advertising? Like, no, we didn't even put one in any boxes anywhere. I'd be interested. Is there anything like pre, you know, 2006? Has anybody gotten anything like that? Oh, oh. okay. Oh, 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 okay, oh. Mew. We see you, Mew. I like this card. I do too. Very, very fun card. It is. So we got Mew. Hey, well, I can say these don't seem, at least based off that, it doesn't seem like those other ones where I felt like we were getting weighed packs. That is true, because you can't really weigh the cardboard ones. From and granted, I'm maybe that was just bad luck, but when you open a boot, uh, excuse me, a mystery box, and you get, what was it, four packs or something? And, and get no, no pulls. Not even a hollow rare? Yeah. That, I don't know. Something, something was up. <laughs> yeah. So this is Vivid Voltage, which we still have some things we need. Oh yeah, Kurt Angle's metal. That's right. <laughs> Got a Galarian Stun Fisk. Ferro Seed, Joltic, Sandal, C Dot, Picapec, a Reverse Bee Drill, and Explode. Explode. <laughs> All right, last pack of Vivid. Oh goodness, this one is like the packs all the way at the top. I feel like I I, know. it's like oh, oh, and a glue. Oh, oh no. no! Oh goodness, this one's in bad shape, y'all. Oh, we're gonna have to doctor this little guy up a little bit. Poor guy, he's, he's been folded been all up. And stuck. And contorted, and oh. Goodness, y'all, this. Oh, we're no. We're gonna just have to open it from the opposite end. That's all sticky and Watch nasty. there be like a rainbow rare. Is it, this is vivid, right? Yeah, this is Watch vivid. there be a rainbow rare Pikachu V Max inside or of this. Or the Pikachu Purple Pikachu V. <laughs> either or, I'd be very happy with gotta, either. Gotta throw that in there, huh? It's just not a suspicious food tin. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The card that shall not be named. <laughs> oh man. Mm. What 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 card can you possibly manifest up in this set? I would love a Pikachu. Yeah, keep keep saying it. 
Keep saying it. Pikachu. 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 <laughs> Whimsic cut. Whimsic cut. Got some uh, Briostars. Non holler rare. Briostars vibes rare. on that one. <laughs> so on to mystery box number two. <laughs> Sticky pack. Just oh goodness, y'all. Wait, you just ruin the surprise, why don't you? I mean, I'm trying to be like, you know, let people see. This is. So oh. We got a oh. Burning Shadows there. Oh. And at least we did get. <laughs> that, just, that just looks so painful. And their poor Charizard's got his head here cut off. I know. Oh. Oh, man. I'm not even going to. Poor Darkness and Blaze. Usually this is a set that causes us much pain. But it's been in pain for a while in that box. Yeah, I mean, mm. You gotta feel for these little cardboard packs. They've really been through <laughs> They've it. They've really been through it. <laughs> <laughs> Sitting on the shelves, bent in half like that all by their lonesome. Yeah, I guess that's why you're not seeing as many of these packs actually on the shelves now. They're taking all the bulk or excess of these and putting them in these boxes. <laughs> So we've got a Centret, Rowlet, a Simeon. Okay, Galarian Stunfist, we see you. Yeah, are you excited about that? <laughs> okay, mm -hmm. okay. He's kind of, you know, he looks like some of the packs there with his little angle. Yeah. He's kind of bent and jagged and, you know. Well, look, this one just, the oh, glue just, didn't even stick. Hey. Mm -hmm. Poor Celebi. Pee. So the, this is vivid ball. And the, oh, you actually saved chilling rain for I was being, Brave move. I was being nice to chilling rain move. since it is our one chilling rain pack in the mystery boxes. I won't say anything else. The packs could be surprising. Swell. Zebstrika. Riolu. Chimeco. The little cat crocheted one. Ninkata. Baltor. Rockruff. Some Trubbish. Yep. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. There we go. <laughs> well, oh, here we go. At least, here like you we said, we have go. gotten something. Ladies and gentlemen, Shilling Rain has been saved as the last pack of the mystery boxes, at least before the tens. Will Chilling Rain provide anything worth pulling? Find out today on Poke Storm Z. Karen's Conviction, Weeding Gloves, Echoing Horn, Shuppet. We got a snowy form, cast form. Ghastly. Cub Foo. Hatina. We have a reverse hollow Diglett, followed up by Galarian Wheezing Non Hollow. Rare. And they're suffocating gas. Oh my. Typical chilling rain pack there today on Poke Storm Z. <laughs> Guys. Yep, we have we have some fun over here. <laughs> so I went ahead and took the um, paper off of these, a little clear wrap, but I just wanted y'all to see the back, and this is what I looked at um, when I was trying to decide what to do. Apparently there are five artworks. They only had three today. So there's two packs and a coin. It did say on here 2019. Yeah, they're copyrighted. So I didn't know, you know, if maybe <laughs> they might be an older tin that just hasn't been out. They came up on the Walmart app when you scan them as a sun and moon tin. So I'm hopeful that there's something sun and moon in here maybe. Just for a little, you know, older set. Sun and moon is slowly becoming, you know, more of a, oh, vivid. I mean, not bad. Just not sun and moon. Vivid, vivid and, and darkness. darkness. Wow. Okay. I mean, that's fine. Well, if you got to get a sword and shield set, this is not, it's not Rebel Flash. We'll open darkness first and then be ready. Will today be the day that Charizard VMAX is pulled? I don't Will know. today be that day? I don't know. It would be nice. It would be very nice. That That is a question daily. 
oh, every time I see this, it makes me think no. Because the struggle, the struggle comes in hot. Get it. <laughs> Jiggly. Oh. Jiggly is usually a good, good sign. Yeah. Jiggly is usually a good sign. Galarian Mr. Rhyme and a Grand Bull. So not today, um, Skitty was We're not. staying positive. Skitty was not on our side yet, but We're maybe. We're staying positive. Skitty and Jiggly were trying to help us. So we got another Vivid. So. Yeah. The two cards we're looking for <laughs> from this are, of course, the Rainbow Rare Pikachu V Max, as we mentioned, and also the Pink and Purple Pikachu V Full Art. Yep. If y'all didn't know, we, we say it. Anytime we open Vivid, I feel like that's become our little thing. We got a Blitzel, Reverse Galvantula. Oh! Okay. Okay. I'll take nice. that. I will take that. Full Art Alakazam V. That's a cool card. That is a really cool card. I really am digging that. Zen Spoon. That's pretty cool. Zen Spoon. Everybody needs some Zen Spoons. Yeah. That sounds like the name of like some sort of a cereal they should come out with. Oh, What'd you eat for breakfast this morning? Zen Spoon. Zen Spoon. And have like Alakazam on the front. <laughs> so we have this You can eat it with Brock's grits. <laughs> right. Cha! Look at him showing his little yeah, tail. I like this tin. I know. It's really cute. I want to see if we can find the other tins at some point because I really I always like completing like the full little set of artwork. I know. That's one of my favorite. So that shows I guess on the back. Two feet tall, 18.7 pounds. Yep. So it looks like the two tins they did not have today are the one with Pikachu and is that? Magnemite. 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 And then Magnemite. It looks like Squirtle and Magikarp. So I'd like to find those just because that would be really neat. And we have these same ones again, but that is okay. These, they're, like Cameron said, they're cute. Oh, sorry. Could be a lot worse sets to be opening. Yeah, I was going to say, if you've got to get some modern sets, I'm not going to complain about Darkness of Blaze and Vivid Voltage. Vivid Voltage especially has been one of our kind of more favorite sets to open. I know we've opened a lot of it um, while it's been out, but I just feel like there's always neat artwork. I really like the amazing rares in it. Yeah, those are really good. So this one is Darkness First. And we've just been on a hunt for, you know, our buddy Charizard for a very, very long time. Yeah, that is the goal of the channel at this point. So we did get a Hollow Rare Milotic. Mm -hmm. We'll give that its moment in our VIP section over there. <laughs> Yep, we have been talking about trying to pull that Charizard, and I think the reason we talk about it so much is because I don't even know between the number of booster boxes, number of booster packs, the little, for a while we were buying a ton of the three pack blisters um, that had Darkness of Blade Lots in it. of these little cardboard blisters, like tons. Well, and now it gets included in everything, kind of like these mini tins. So we've opened a ton of it and cannot pull the cards. Cannot. Mm-mm. But we're on Vivid now, which means we're looking for Pikachu. Please, Pikachu. Very Kanto heavy stuff. Please, Pikachu. Oh, I do like I that still Electrode. Like electrode. I always got Manectric. Well, you know, we're getting It's Manectric. A, you gotta feel it. It's Manectric. <laughs> um, so we're actually in the right family because we got some Electric type, but. Well, I think that's kind of the thing with Vivid. I know it is, much. but I'm just saying, you know, the last two it's cards not there. It's called like Vivid Water. Oh, look yes. at this. This is somebody's favorite. This is my here. favorite tin because you got an Eve and a Chan Chanthi. Chan Chanthi. That's a really cute one. Now, here's my thing. How did Chan Chanthi get on top of this rock? It was a struggle. <laughs> she used the struggle <laughs> clothes to climb up. That's right. <laughs> I mean, the rock's bigger than Chan Chanthi, and Chan Chanthi does not really have. Oh, very long arms, arms or, or legs or, or any legs at all. She's just kind of a like little body feet. It's on like feet. and little tiny feet with the little pink shoes. <laughs> That's <her> shoes on. <laughs> it's probably part of its body, but you know. Anyway. <laughs> Chan Chancy. Again, one of the Pokemon featured in my pink, purple, round, and cute Pokemon binder. Yes. <laughs> 
There's lots of uh, lots of cute little Pokemon in there. <laughs> we got Energy, Vibrava, Katharita, Pokemon Breeders Nurturing, Toxel, Skitty. Cat kick. I know, I saw that. <laughs> Rowlet. Poor wishy washy. I'm trying to pull this on too. Mm hmm. Cufant. You got a reverse club chief. Oh, all right. I do like that Crobat V. We have gotten it quite a bit. Yeah, I was going <laughs> to say, we have pulled that quite a few times. Again, one of the many repeats that we've gotten <laughs> in our quest for Charizard. On to our last pack for today. I think that's the thing. It's like even some of the other cards that we've gotten. It would be nice to pull, you know, I know that, like there's a Salamence mm -hmm. and a Salamence VMAX, I think, in the set. We've gotten those, but like one time. Yeah. But like we pulled a ton of Crobats. Lots of those. And I don't know. It would be neat just to see a, a few of the other different cards too. At least, you know, while we're, we'll probably be opening to look for Charizard for three more years. Mm-hmm. At this rate. Hopefully not for Pikachu, but you know, we're kind of. I will say this is our last pack. Is that our last card? Mm -hmm. Well, ladies and gentlemen, not a whole lot of hype behind that. Terrakian. Definitely not a suspicious food yet. But I'll say I do like the Mew V. Mew V and Alakazam. Are Definitely my, my favorites for today. Yeah. And then we got the Hollow Milotic, the Galarian Stunfisk, and the Crobat V. So yeah. not bad. No, not but bad. But still, I think we're going to have to go pick up a few more of these mystery boxes just, just for, to see, you know, just for research Yeah, purposes, we need it right? for research because, I mean, one out of ten boxes, you would think, you would think maybe we can find something. Hey, I'll take one of those Shining Legends packs like that on the back. Me too. Well, guys, I hope you liked the video. A little something different here today. We're back in the kitchen which many of you may remember from our early <laughs> days here in the channel. Okay, you just have to you yeah, know, still, revisit the kitchen. Yeah, but make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and we will talk to you guys later.